It was an ordinary evening. As always, I set up late at work. I work at home. I live alone. I have no wife yet. And after I smoked cigarette and a drunk mug of tea, I went to wash in the shower before going to bed. Everything was fine until the light suddenly went out in the bathroom. They must have turned off the lights all over the house again. Wrapping myself in a towel, I went out into the corridor to check what was the matter. And when was my surprise when I discovered that everywhere in the apartment there was light except for the bathroom. Moreover, the bulb was intact and the light was turned off using a switch. Damn, I thought and went to wash on. Before I could get into the bath, the light went out again. Here it was really scared to me. I stood wet in a dark bathroom, which had three large mirrors. Imagine how I felt. Suddenly from the corridor come the sounds of the opening front door to the apartment. When I was completely numb, and could not make not only a movement, but even a sight. Outside the door, footsteps erupted into running, and suddenly I heard an approaching rumble of something. At that moment it seemed to me what an explosion of terrible power was heard in the bathroom. I ran into the corridor like a stupefied one, ran up to the room with my eyes closed and as a child I jumped into bed under the covers. I lay there for about 20 minutes until I was completely convinced what there was a lull in the apartment. But what happened next? In my apartment all six mirrors were broken, three in the bathroom, two in the hallway and one in the room. I almost went crazy and drank two packs of valerian. Only after what I calmed down a bit and called a friend to come to spend what night with me. As you know, it was very scary. Andrew, my friend, advised me to turn to father to check my apartment and sprinkle to with holy water. The other day I am waiting for the arrival of the holy father. And since then. I haven't slept in the apartment yet. I live now with a friend.